In the 31st meeting on the gridiron of two longtime rivals, the 2 and one Bulldogs hosted the 1-2 and two Eagles in a Mac Red matchup at Barnabu Field. Early Blake Rastigue and Ian Kennelly look for the quick strike, but the Bulldogs have it covered. A couple of plays later and Rastigue tries again. This time it's laid out perfectly for Kennelly. And Ike takes the early lead at Romeo, seven to nothing. The rest of the first quarter saw each team fighting for yardage. and punishing the ball carriers with each opportunity. Late in the second quarter, the Eagles lost the ball on an interception, which gave Romeo great field position. and Went would get the call at the goal line, and Romeo ties it, seven to seven. Late in the first half, the defenses made it so neither team could put more points on the board, as the half ended, seven to seven. In the second half, the Eagles' Massimo D'Aristotle and the Eagles get deep into Bulldog territory. But Ryan Humbuck would end the Eagles' drive with an interception in the end zone. On defense, Ike's James Collin makes a great stop on running back Ryan Chapsky. Then Colleen Duda to catch Horn in the backfield. But Horn and the Bulldogs would eventually reach Pader, and Romeo took a 14 7 lead. Despite a nice catch and run by Nathan Pettipool, the Eagles were forced to punt. But due to a slip up receiving it, the Eagles come up with the ball. Caleb Oyster in the Eagle offense would end up scoring another touchdown, making it 14 to 14. There the stage was set for Brock Horn. 55 yards and the Bulldogs were back up, 21 to 14. The Eagles put together their last drive in the face of some tough Bulldog defense. In a last effort, a scrambling Rastigue spots Dierra Stottle in the end zone. But what looks like a no-brainer call for defensive pass interference is not called. But there was a penalty on the play holding on the offense, and Romeo gets the ball and the victory over the Eagles, 21 to 14. Sports give so many opportunities to kids. It gives them an opportunity to see where they fit within a team, persevere, understanding how to work with different personalities. Those are the lessons that will make you a successful adult. As a mom, you have to have an understanding of what concussions are. Concussions are things that are treatable. If we take care of athletes, they will be able to develop and have a long, happy, healthy life. 